What's up guys, it's Josh, welcome back to another Minecraft video, and this is Season 2, Episode 1 of our Mod Spotlight Show. Today we are using the Armor Movement Mod, which is made by the forum user jsut210. The link to download this mod will be in the description, as always, and let's just start off with this mod. So, what this mod adds into the game is a whole bunch of new armor and different features. So let's start off showing you guys what the jetpack does, and how to use a jetpack or how it is crafted. All these recipes are actually on the forum post, so instead of wasting time showing you how to do that, I decided to let you guys figure this out. So let's use this jetpack. All we have to do is press space, and we'll start flying up. So I'm going to fly up to here and demonstrate the next part of this mod. But you can see we let go of space bar, we fall down, we hit it again, we go up. It's kind of like the Tekkit jetpack, or the jetpack that's part of uh, the... I believe Billcraft mod or Industrial Craft. I'm not sure which one of those two it's from, but it's very cool. And when we fall, we do not take any fall damage, which is nice. So let's fly up there and let's show off the next part of this mod. So the next part of this mod is actually called the glider. And what you do with it, place it on your back. And when you jump off, you'll actually fall. But once you hit the action key and hold it down, you glide down nice and easily. So let's head back up there and we'll show you guys how it works one more time. So we're going to jump off, we're going to hit F, and what we'll do is slowly glide down. As you can see, we can control the way we go, side to side, and here we go. We fall to the ground, fall in a sprint, and back to normal. Very, very cool addition to this mod. The next thing we have is the life vest, and what this allows us to do is jump into water that is more than too deep, and it will let us float, so it acts just like a life jacket or a life vest, wherever your custom of saying it is, but you can see here it won't let us go under the water, and we can actually swim with it on, very, very cool. Speaking of features in the water, we also have flippers and scuba helmet. And what the flippers let us do is move faster underwater. And what scuba helmet does is let us breathe underwater for much longer. So you can see we're using our flippers and we're moving underwater fast. And what the flippers do when you're above water is actually they slow you down. So they're not good to have when you're not in water. But when you're in it, they are great. So you can see I'm running right now and they're slow. We can take them off. And you can see we go faster. Now let's go to F5 and look at our face. Look how funny we look. Now I want to put the flippers on. Let's look at our feet. Alright, so they do look kind of like they are just boots modified. So that would be cool if they stuck out from the bottom. But so far they are very awesome looking. Similar to the jetpack, we have the helicopter hat. What it lets us do is fly up and down. Slower for sure. But it's used the same way. Hold space bar and it will fly you up, let go of it, it'll take you down. And hitting the action key, which is F, doesn't do anything. Which is very cool. So, let's just fly home with this. Let's go skydiving. Whoo, hit the action key, and now we fall down. Haha. -ha. We are using our parachute now. Very cool, let's just slowly glide down, let go, and all the way to the ground. Very fast, very efficient. I want to get to this biome over here, so let's use our grappling hook and throw it. And you can see we throw it and it'll take us to where we throw it. It's kind of like the ender pearl without taking any damage. And it can take us up there or not let us stay up there. There we go. So very cool, this is the grappling hook. Since we're in a snow biome now, I thought it'd be appropriate to show you guys the ice skates. And look how much faster we move when we're on ice with our ice skates on our feet. Aw oh, yeah. Now you don't have to do slow walking on ice. Awesome part two. Let's actually throw on, since we're right here, the spring boots. And let's jump our way over to a mountain over there. So you can see the spring boots, they give us a spring jump, and they suppress your fall damage to nothing. Which is very nice and very efficient, Surpri or knowing that your spring boots are helping you through the way. So we're going to head over to this mountain over here, and we're going to throw on our mountain boots. 
And we can cl now climb up a mountain. You can see fall down, take damage, but I guess you can't look away. You can climb up straight up very nice. And there we go, right up this mountain. Oh, that looks like a little glitch going on here. <laughs> That's pretty funny. We got these stylish heelys on. I think they're supposed to be like wheelie shoes. And if we hit the action key, we sprint without taking any damage. Or without taking any hummer, hunger damage, which is very cool. Feature you can see we get the sprint look. And all we have to do is hit forward. It's kind of like a cheating sprint. But oh well, I really like it. Now... This mod, as I was saying earlier, adds a whole bunch of features into the game that you would not regularly have. And it adds features to more armor that, in my opinion, parts of these should be implemented into default Minecraft. So anyway guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. I did forget to show you one thing, and it's the banana, which has no use, but you can eat it, and it will fill your hunger. Maybe we could find these in the jungle a little bit, Jeb. Hint, hint. Alright, anyway guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, could you please leave a rating, let me know how I did, and I'll see you in the next one. And always remember, Ingabar.